Hi, my name is Sam Was One, and today we're going to be looking at what has actually been praised as the best map in the game. This map is CTF Double Cross. It's a fairly balanced map with a large open center, tight sewers as an alternate route, sniper battlements with flank access, a tall intelligence room, and a well-placed spawn that allows for you to leave three separate parts of it on the map. And I bloody ah! hate it. The fact that there's so much balance in room placement and so few sharp corners makes it hard to find broken heavy strats. Well, might as well get started. Firstly, like with all maps, there's a few basic rules that I've learned about this map. Number one, don't stay in the sniper sight lines. Usually snipers are on the battlements or behind their tool shed. Stay out of their view if you see one peeking, and you shouldn't die as easily. Number two, watch out for pyros on the lower bridge. All it takes is one right click to knock anyone off the cliff here, and you don't want that. Thank you. Number three, always assume that there is a sentry on the inside balcony outside if the enemy spawn. This is an incredibly viable place to drop one, and it's hard to counter due to the railing blocking about a third of the shots on it. Number four, check your own sewers every now and then for sentry nests. It's fun placing teleporters behind the gas tank there. Number five, remember that Heavy's minigun does less damage over longer distances, so only fire at targets on the other side of the map if you're sure you can kill them, or you're sure you won't get killed in the meantime. Alright, specific spots time. At first when writing the script for this video, I thought I'd nailed down the three exact locations that were the best, but as I put off making the video and kept playing on the map, I discovered there were so many more good locations, so I'll try my best and cover most of them. There are two very definitive aspects of this map, as I see it. Offense zones and defense zones. Pretty much everything past your base is offense, including the neutral middle zone. Anything in your base is defense. There are two different playstyles that you can then choose, naturally, offense or defense. Defense strategies are going to be focused on patience and viewpoints. First and foremost, my favorite spot for defense are the two sharp corners in the entrance to friendly sewers. Nobody really expects someone to camp right outside and exit to their own spawn, so simply being here for a while can confuse a lot of people and rack up a fair amount of kills. Keep in mind that eventually people will catch on to your shenanigans and focus you to try and punish repetition, so make sure to shift from the right corner to the left and vice versa every now and then. Secondly, it took me a long time to realize just how good Heavy is in the actual intelligence room. It's a perfect mix of high ground, which is good for both evading sight and giving the foe a false sense of security, and crampedness? Closeness? I don't know, you, you know what I'm going for. It's a room with only three exits, and when compared to its size, this makes for some decent cutthroat situations. Finally on defense are the infamous sniper battlements. This is a more specialized spot for heavy, more used for gunning down early scout rushes and overconfident soldiers, but it's still not that bad a pick. On offense, stay out of the main area unless you have to. If the enemy team has even a single competent soldier or sniper, or even a pirate that just knows how to right click, <laughs> you will die. That is simply a fact. Keeping this in mind, the reverse of the first spot on defense I mentioned works here as well. Sticking close to the enemy team's sewer entrance allows you to camp their lower spawn exit, cover retreating damaged units, and act as a force of chaos for anyone else on their team that knows how to communicate. It's pretty fun to pick off people who would have escaped with low health, knowing that you stopped them from healing. Next comes a nearby area, the stairs that go from the sewers all the way up to the balcony. This is like the stairway from Two Fort. If you know how to look up and focus on what's going on above you through the tiny cracks that you can see through, nailing enemies to the ceiling from the floor beneath them is both fun and unexpected. Oh 
Just make sure that whatever happens, you don't get too bad tunnel vision. As with this spot, I've noticed I get flanked by spies a lot. <laughs> Bloody Frenchies. Anywho, final spot on this map is similar to defense, but with a twist. The same sniper balconies on the enemy team are infinitely harder to get to than your own as heavy. But if you can make it there, you can shut down enemy snipers, cut off a main way out of their spawn area, distract forces from the main gate in front of the base, and sometimes even get that fat dunk on people retreating into the sewers. You have no idea how satisfying it is to jump off the balcony and absolutely destroy people below. Okay, a few more bonus advice section. <coughs> Number one. This map has sewers. I thought it was interesting that Heavy always seems to do well in sewers. You know, two fort, sawmill, stuff like that. Eh, maybe it's just me. Number two. As a scout, I dared a friend to cap the intel on a pub server the other day in under a minute from the Rhine start. He did it in under 30 seconds. Woo! When playing Heavy, Remember that in the very beginning, it is your immediate duty to play the intended role of defense. When a round starts, unless anyone else explicitly shouts it in voice chat that they're headed that way, go to the intel room and guard it until a sentry is set up. It's only responsible. Number three, since this is a larger map, communication is key. Please talk to your team regularly and make sure they know what's going on. You see a spy come out of their spawn and immediately disguise as someone? Gentlemen! Report it. You take down a medic behind a large bush? <gasps> Report it. You see, or die to, a cheeky sentry position? Report it. Simple stuff like that can save your team's lives on any map, but this one specifically. Ugh, I need some sleep. Thanks for tuning in to this fairly short strategy video, and let me know what you think. I'm well aware that these strategies were fairly limited in perspective, as I was the only one making this script, so leave a comment down below how you deal with noobs on Double Cross. Also, keep in mind, I have a Twitch channel, so be sure to go check that out at twitch.tv slash samwiz1 for Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays in the evening for stale memes on a regular basis. Thank you so much for being here and helping me grow a tiny gaming community, and I'll see you later. Have a great day. Is anyone out there? Hello? Please let me go! Let me go! I just want to leave! Please! the reference Alert. the enemy has taken our intelligence good on you blue